assignment two, just showing you guys the animation, not the dynamics part. But uh, yeah, let's see. So maybe it will be clear more in the simulation uh, when I run this. So again, I have you know signal generator. This is the VTOL animation which I kind of created here. Yeah, VTOL animation in the in the viewer. And when I so I'm manually inputting a couple of things. So when I I'm manually inputting Z, which is Z, Z V in the picture. So Z and Z V are same. Vehicles displacement from the center is Z V or Z. H is the height. Theta. And you know. Uh, yep. So. Z reference, I think, is the is the target that we need to track. Okay, so Z reference is the target that later on. So you're mo you're in moving Z reference independently of Z. So Z will be governed by the kinematics and dynamics, and Z reference is the target that we're talking about. So yeah, I think kind of a, apologies. I think in the book they use Z V and Z T, and here we are using Z and Z reference. Okay. So let me run it and you will see this. So we'll see. Right now, just, everything is manual. There is no kinematics. So, you know, this is the target I was talking about Z reference here. It's moving independently. Later on, we'll see that the, the 2D helicopter has to track this Z reference. Right now, everything is manual. So, yeah, enjoy. Thank you. I will upload another kinematics video uh, later. Thank you.